Yo, welcome back to another video. I hope you guys are having an amazing day. And today I'm doing some more pet training. This video is going to be kind of everywhere, I guess. Well, not entirely. It's kind of what I used to do in the past when I did a bunch of blind pets to Mega in one video. So I'm going to do something similar to that pretty much. But yeah, there's some specific pet that I do want to make, but I am going to take it up blind because I was looking inside the kiosk. And there really isn't any good pets for what I want to make. I'm going to show you guys right now. So I want to make a bounce blade pet for Myth. And you go inside the kiosk, you can see there's some trash pets. There's literally no good ones. And if you keep going, there's like literally nothing. The only decent one is like kind of this one, but it only has two talents and the uh, the stats are super low on it. And then you go over here and there's this one. And this is the one that I think I'm going to hatch with. The only problem is it has make has steel ward instead of proof. And I'm assuming the guy was probably going for proof instead of steel ward. But you know, I don't really know that for a fact. I did do a hatch with this pet on stream and I ended up failing with something super bad. It was so sad. Yeah, it's one away. All right, I'm covering up my screen for this. All we need is, is it Myth Dealer? Yeah, all we need is Myth Dealer. If this shit gets Myth Dealer, perfect. Perfecto. Myth Dealer, please. That's all I need, Myth Dealer. Boone? No. You're joking. It better not be Boone. Is, I think it's Boone. It was so close. The pet didn't end up too bad, but I don't want to rehatch with myself because I'm scared that it's just going to get Myth Boon again. So I'm just going to hatch with him again. I'm going to take it up blind. Hopefully we don't get Steel Ward because we didn't even get it last time. But yeah, if I can make this pet with like Balance Blade instead of Mighty, that would probably be the best. I'm not going to lie. So let's hatch these two together. Whose pet did I get? I think I got his. Oh no, I got mine. They're both the same name. Okay, that's so good. I actually didn't know that. I'm gonna check the pool really quick. And it doesn't even have Boon this time. Why is it only Ultra Rares and Epics? That is super weird. So I'm gonna go put it on my balance and then we're gonna start training it up. The ideal pet would probably be Proof, Double Damage, Armor Breaker, and then Maycast Balance Blade. That is probably the best. So I'm going to do this blind like I said. So I'm going to have to cover up my screen literally after two hatches. Or not two hatches, two trains. So I'm going to cover up my screen now. I'm going to use my phone. You guys will be able to see what it is obviously. But I won't be able to see what it is. So I'm going to take it from baby to mega blind without looking at it. So you guys can see that now I think. I'm really hoping we get Maycast Bounce Blade early on. If we do that would be so nice. But is it already one away? I don't even know. I don't want to risk it because like, all right, if I use a fancy yogurt, it is. So I'm going to cover up my screen again. You guys can see that. I really do hope we get balance blade. Like I said, if we don't, that's going to be kind of sad. But pet training is just so fast. I think it's already, is it two away? Yeah, I think that's two away. So I'm going to cover up my screen again. Like I said, I'm hoping for make has balance blade if it didn't already get it. That'd be nice if it already has it, but I literally don't know. So yeah, you guys can see that. Please be make ass balance blade. Please be something that I want, obviously. Okay, we're already one train away, and I haven't even used two energy elixirs yet. I've literally only used one energy elixir. And no, look at my golden wheat breads. 666. Man, that has to be unlucky for something. I'm gonna use it. I mean, if it fails on this train, it's because I used the golden wheat breads, but it's okay. I'm gonna cover up my screen. You guys can see that. Please be balance blade. Please be something that I don't have, or like something that I want, is what I mean. But yeah, I definitely need Balance Blade. If this pet doesn't already have Balance Blade, that's super bad. But obviously, I'm going to take it up the Mega because I have no idea what this pet has. You know what I just noticed? It got Mighty because the strength went up. So did it just get it there or did I, or did I just not notice? I think I have been training up the strength the entire time. So it had to have got it at Epic, I'm pretty sure. But I mean, I, wait, did I want Mighty? No, I didn't want Mighty. Okay, that could be bad. I mean, if it got Mighty instead of, like, Pain Giver, then maybe. Yeah, that wouldn't be too bad. But I guess we're just gonna have to see the pet. I think it's... How many trains? I think it's, like, three. Or it's probably four. But that's fine. Bro, it only takes two Energy Elixirs to train a pet from Baby to Mega when it's double pet XP. That is so insane. That's why I don't care about blinding pets. That's 500 crowns. And if I don't have to use a Perot, then yeah, it's only 500 crowns. That's why it's so nice. But okay, this pet is already one train away from Mega. So, you know, I don't think I'm going to cover up my screen for this one. 
because I do want to see if it fails at Mega specifically. So let's just feed it the snack. Spell proof? Okay, we definitely needed that. We definitely needed spell proof. So I'm just going to check the stats right now and see what we have. That's not even dealer. And we didn't have Defy in the pool. So, oh, shit. I don't think this can be good. If we didn't get dealer and we didn't get Defy either, that's just that's not a good sign. Please, don't be too bad. At least have make us balance blade. Oh no, wait, that could have been nice too. That could have been so nice. Damn, wait, imagine if that got dealer instead of uh, pain giver. I could have just socked it on brace defy. It wouldn't have been the best because reliquary doesn't really cast anymore, but still. That's honestly not even that bad if it got dealer instead of pain giver. I didn't even know reliquary was in the pool though. Because none of our pets had it. I mean, at least we didn't get Steel Ward. Actually, to be honest, I probably would have rather Steel Ward over Reliquary. Just because that's different. I already have some pretty decent Reliquary pets. But, you know, it's fine. I don't even really care. It's fine. I have another pet that I want to make. It is another one that failed on stream. So, I'm going to go over onto my other character that I have it on. And we're going to hatch with a pet that I'm pretty sure is still inside of the kiosk. Okay, so next up, I'm on my life now. And this is a pet that I also failed on stream. I think I already said that. Okay, I'm taking up the pet. Give me dealer, please. You guys can see that. All I need is dealer. Steel ward? No, if it's steel ward, that's not even that bad gas no wait that's not even that bad steel ward i mean it's not that great but it's not that bad okay it's obviously not dealer we, we can set that straight please if it's actually steel ward i'll take that how are you gonna lie to me like that straight to my face legion shield out of everything fucking legion shield all it needed was dealer if it got death dealer literally any dealer would have been fine i'm not gonna lie but like specifically death dealer because that was in the pool i already knew that and this is specifically a death pet but yeah if it got dealer this would have been so clean i would have been so happy i could have put on dragon lance onto this and it would have been so nice but yeah obviously we didn't get dealer we got legion shield but there was a specific pet inside the kiosk that i was hatching with a bunch and that's how i ended up getting that close so i'm gonna try and find that one again and if it is in the kiosk again I'm probably just going to hatch with that one. Okay, it is still inside the kiosk. So you can see our pools are pretty much the exact same. There's like one ultra rare that he doesn't have. But I do have the ultra rare that is death dealer. And pretty much everything else is in the exact same spot. So I'm assuming that I did get legion shield from his pet. Because it is an epic down there. So I'm really hoping I don't get that again, obviously. And since I'm hatching with a pet that got it manifested, I'm assuming I'm going to get it again. So it's definitely not smart to blind this to Mega. But I'm going to do it anyways. I don't really care. It I like doing risky shit. I like doing dumb shit. So we're going to do it this time. And hopefully we can actually get Death Dealer. But yeah, I've been trying to make this pet for a while. So hopefully I can make it today. But let's hatch them. And it is available. I'm happy about that. I'm actually going to go and get the energy gear off of my balance really quick. Because that gives me up to 200 energy. And that means I won't have to spend more than two energy elixirs. Now I'm going to hatch the pet. And it is right here. Willy Dakota. That name's kind of sus. I'm not going to lie. That's kind of weird. But it's okay. We're going to blind this pet right now. I really hope we don't get Legion Shield again. If we get Legion Shield, I'm going to be kind of pissed. But okay, I'm going to blind it up. So here, I'm going to train up to Teen really quick. You guys will be able to see the talent. Please don't get Legion Shield. If this shit gets Legion Shield early on, I'm going to be kind of pissed. But okay, it's already one train away from Adult. So let's train it up again. I'm really hoping that we do get Death Dealer. Because that is the thing that I was missing. So if we do get that early on, then the pet might not be... Well, it has a, probably a less chance of failing. No, well, okay, I can't say that either, because it still has, like, the same chance of getting Legion Shield, but it's just a better pet if it has Death Dealer, because that's the thing that I was missing. That's pretty much it, but okay, it's already at Ancient, and I can't even see the talents anyways, so there's no point, like, it's either it fails with Legion Shield... Or it just doesn't fail with Legion Shield. That's pretty much the only thing. But also, I've been failing with Unshakable on this pet so much. Holy shit. If I could look at the pet pool right now, I would show you exactly where it is. It's an ultra rare and it's so annoying. I'm telling you, I've got that at least five times trying to make this pet. It's the most fucking annoying thing. Even if you don't have it manifested, you're going to get it like 50 times no matter what. But okay, I'm going to train it up right now. And I'm going to cover up my screen so you guys can see that. 
I'm really hoping that we have Death Dealer already. I kind of have high hopes, but yeah, I'm gonna take it up to Epic. All right, the pet's one train away from Epic. Like I said, I hope it has Death Dealer already. If it has Bounce Blade, that'd be super nice too, because that's the main reason I am making this Death Pet. So yeah, I'm gonna train it up. You guys will be able to see what it gets, and obviously I won't because I'm doing it blind from Baby to Mega. But yeah, you guys can see that. Please be Death Dealer if I don't already have it. So... I guess I'm just gonna take this one up the Mega. The pet's one trade away from Mega. I'm telling you, this is so quick when it's double pet XP. Like, it's only been five minutes. I've been able to take it from Baby to Mega. Obviously, if you have Mega Snacks, it's gonna be quick. But, like, double pet XP makes everything so much nicer. So, even if this pet fails... Well, obviously, I'm going to be mad, but, like, I won't be as pissed as if it was, like, not double pet XP. So, yeah, I'm going to see what it gets at Mega because I do like seeing if it fails at Mega or not. So, let's just feed it the snack. Hopefully, it gets something I need. Death Dealer. Holy shit. Okay, wait. Bro, okay, if this didn't already get Legion Shield or Unshakable, I'm telling you that shit is so sticky. But this is the talent that I needed. This is the talent that I needed last time at Mega, and I got Legion Shield. You guys already saw that, obviously. But holy shit, if this pet is so- if this is perfect, I'm gonna cry. This is gonna be so nice. Blind? That would be so perfect. So let's just check the stats. Okay, that's not the right page. Obviously, we got dealer. That's double resist. That is double resist. I'm pretty sure on my life that's double resist. That should be proof in defy. Please, pierce be there. I think that's the pierce. I'm pretty sure that's the pierce. That should be. What else would that be? I don't I don't know what else pierce I don't know what other pierce I have on my life. Okay, let's just check the pet, please. If that's bounce blade too. No! That wasn't the pierce. No legion shield, bro. Why? Why was it it's always so close? Holy shit, that was so close. When did it get legion shield? When did it get legion shield? No way. I'm telling you, if it got Legion Shield at, like, teen or adult, I'm going to be pissed. But, at le okay, here's the thing, though. Now, if the pet comes out of the kiosk, I can still have a pretty good chance of actually making it, though. Because I have all five of the talents that I need manifested in the pool now. So, I could just rehatch these ones together, hopefully get rid of Legion Shield, and then I'd be fine. But that's still just super annoying. But yeah, I'm just going to end the video off here. This is kind of like a throwback because this is what I used to do a long time ago. I would just train up a bunch of random pets. Even though these ones weren't really random, they were still blind and they went from baby to mega. So I hope you guys did enjoy. And if you did, then make sure to leave a like and also subscribe. And my Discord server will be the top link in the description. So make sure to join that. But yeah, I'll see you guys next time.